Hey guys, Greg here with RW Stilling. Hey, today what I want to go over with you guys is um, the fabrication of the secondary condenser. Um, this, this is what uh, you can you can buy this on online, or you or you can fabricate it. You can buy the components for it. We have all that online. Go to rwdistilling.com. Um, this is uh, this is where the final product comes out of. So I just wanted to uh, show you that, show you how to fabricate it for all you fabricators out there, and uh, and just so, so you know, I, I do I do cut all my stuff on a on a. Uh, a uh, DeWalt chop saw. So, um, if you guys do decide to use that that product or that machine to, to make your cuts, uh, make sure that you wear the, your eye protection. But it does th throw off shards of, of, of copper, and, it, and it's very dangerous. So, make sure you, you protect your eyes real good. So, anyway, I just wanted to show you this is this is what you can buy online on our website rwdistilling.com, or you can fabricate it yourself. So, let's go over that f uh, fabrication process um, with you. And, uh, Show you uh, the components that you're going to need. You're going to need two of the uh, three two reducers. Okay, these uh, these reducers do have a, a rolled stop on the uh, on the uh, front of it. Uh, you need to, you're going to have to uh, file this, or I use a um, oscillating drum sander. I, I stick that on top of it, and it actually goes up inside here and actually uh, takes off that that rolled stop. But uh, if you don't have that, you can use a file and take that off. And the reason you need that is because you need a uh, a, a 14 inch piece of two inch copper pipe. Okay, that actually slides over the top of that and has to uh, has to run past the shoulder of that rolled stop, so it slides on top of that. So you're going to need that. You're going to need two of these. You're going to need one 14-inch uh, piece of 2-inch pipe. You're going to need one piece of 3-inch by 9-inch long pipe, copper pipe. Okay, that piece actually fits on top of that like that. Okay, so you're going to need that. You're going to need a two to half inch reducer. Okay, that's for the uh, the bottom, so the parrot actually fastens to the bottom of that, so you're gonna need one of those. You're gonna need a brass ferrule. Okay, you can order a brass, or you can order a two inch copper ferrule on site, on my website. Uh, these brass ferrules are 99.8% uh, lead free, guys, so trust me, don't worry about anything leaching into your product. These things are 99.8% are lead free, so just want to let you know that. You're going to need two of uh, your uh, half inch adapters, okay? And I'll show you what I do with the, uh, one of these adapters, uh, you know, as, as we go through the process of fabricating this thing. Okay, you're going to need uh, one, you're going to need a uh, half inch adapter here, one with is threaded, that, that, and this, uh, this side is not. So, so this, this actually goes to the parrot, this actually connects to the, to the, uh, the uh, secondary condenser and this, this actually attached to the parrot. So we'll go over that when we get to it. You're going to need four two and a half inch pieces of half inch pipe. Okay, four of those, and you're going to need one. You're going to need one inch and a half pipe. Okay, so so you know that. There's your inch and a half pipe. Okay, that all has to be cleaned. On, on my other some of my other videos, it shows you how to clean these burrs off. So I'm not going to go over all that with you. But again, when you go to make that chop on the, on the chop saw, the cuts on the chop saw, make sure you, you protect your eyes real good. Okay, so bear with me, and I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and go over and clean this stuff up and show you how um, I process this uh, this copper uh, to do the fabrication part. All right, bear with me. Thanks.